Hey, Spirit Scholars. Today, I'm coming to you with a date drink that only after I made it, found out that it is a drink called Nabi's that is favorited by the Prophet Muhammad of Islam. So I thought that was pretty cool information. Nevertheless, having no idea of the information I just gave you, I made it because I really enjoy dates. And normally I buy this brand of dates with the pit. But out and about in TJ Maxx one day, I saw dates on sale and I said, hey, I enjoy dates. Let me get these dates. These are Deglet Noor dates. I was not aware at that time that there is a difference in dates. These are Deglet Noors and these are Medjools. For the record, I like Medjool dates. But stay tuned because I have a comment even about these Medjool dates. Because I had just bought this bag of dates and I did not want to throw them away, even though I did not like the texture of the Deglet Noor dates, I said, what can I do with them? And I decided to steep these dates to get the sweet liquid. And there again, I only found out afterwards that that has, is actually a legit drink in Islamic culture. But here we are. We are going to be, I'm going to show you how to make it because the results were quite delicious and nutritious. So here we go. It's really simple and it's definitely worth a try. So you're gonna take your dates and I have 16 ounces of water. So I'm gonna use 12 dates. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. 11, 12, okay? So I have 12 dates in my mason jar. I'm gonna fill it with water. That was 16 ounces of water. That's risen just a little bit now that the dates are in the jar. Gonna let, you see it's bubbling, gonna let a little bit of those bubbles just come on up. And then I am going to cap this jar. And it's going to steep overnight. So here's what we have. And I will come back tomorrow and show you the results. Okay. While we're here though, I want to make a note about these module dates. So the next opportunity I had after buying these Deglet Noir dates and realizing I just do not like the texture of the Deglet Noir dates. And let me show you the difference. This is a Deglet Noir. Okay. They're slimmer. Um, I would even say a bit smoother. Okay, then your medjool dates. Yes, definitely. Here's your medjools. Let me get a good one. And as you can see, major difference in texture. And I do not prefer the Deglet Noir dates. I feel like they are a lot more fibrous and really not as flavorful. So I pre prefer a medjool date. I would never buy a Deglet Noir for any other reason other than steeping the dates to get the nabis. Okay. Now, in regard to these medjools, I, I think this is very important if you're a date eater and you're learning the differences like I have had to learn. So learn from me and that way you can spend your money on what you think will appeal to you the most. I like medjool dates. I prefer the taste and the texture Usually I eat my dates as a dessert, to be honest. I'll put peanut butter in the middle 
or or some type of nut that I like, but usually it's peanut butter if I'm gonna be completely straight up, straightforward. And I'll just put peanut butter there and I eat it and it tastes like um, a super healthy Snicker bar. Uh, however, this was the first time I bought pitted dates and I'm gonna tell you, I do not like them. <laughs> <laughs> I don't like the pitted medjool dates. I cannot believe it. I'm like, no, I don't like the pitted medjool dates. So, and, and, and I really believe it, it, it changed the texture of the dates to take the pit out. It almost aged the date. And that kind of does make sense to me. Um, the, it's almost like an avocado. The, 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 the date stays fresher with the pit still in it. Um, I feel like the texture is more mushy with the date, um, the, 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 the pit being gone. It just folds easy. No, I'm not a fan of pitted dates. So I will not be buying pitted module dates, only the module dates with the pit in it for me. So therefore I'll be having a lot of nabis <laughs> with my very, very Christian self. With my very, very Christian self, I will be having a lot of nabis because I will not be eating these dates as I would normally eat my non-pitted medjool dates, okay? So I definitely wanted to point that out because if somebody had pointed that out to me before I knew the difference. I certainly would not have purchased these pitted modules. I would have went ahead and bought the module dates with the pit, like I will from now on, but it's okay. Um, I've learned and now I'm sharing that with you. So uh, that's a little information that I wanted to pass on. I will be back tomorrow to show you um, our Nabi's drink um, that we made today with our Deglet Noirs, which are fine for um, steeping and having, let's say a deglet noir or a date tea. That's what I'll call it. I'll call it a date tea. I'm, I'm Christian, I am not Islamic, but in Islam they call it Nabis. It's good information to know, uh, considering that there's over a billion Muslims in the world. And, um, but I'm Christian and I'm gonna call it date tea. How about that? Right here, PhD and me, you've heard it for the first time. It's date tea for me, okay? So, <laughs> so there you have it. I'll see you tomorrow. Right, you guys didn't see my face. Here I am. <laughs> All right, bye, see you tomorrow. Hey, Spirit Scholars. So it is the next day and our date tea has been refrigerated overnight for about 24 hours at this point. And so it turned out great. And I decided to go ahead and do not only the Deglet Noor dates, but the Majul dates also. And I'm so excited that I did that. Just giving it a little shake up here. And as you can see, one is darker than the other. And that is because the Deglet Noor dates that I'm showing you right here have less sugar than the medjool dates that I'm showing you right here. And so this is what they look like after having refrigerated and I've tasted them both and they're both delicious. Just there again, one is sweeter than the other. So I'm excited, I'm gonna enjoy these health benefits and I hope you give it a try. If you do, let me know in the comments and thank you for joining me. Hope you enjoyed this one. Be sure to take care of yourself because you are loved. Just showing you guys here the difference in transparency between the liquids of the Majul and the Deglet Noor dates. And I'm going to wrap it up right here. But thanks again for watching. Give it a try and blessings to you.